my dear netset aspirants my brothers and sisters i heartily welcome all of you i am mr dhanayya sir from village tolanur taluka akalkot district sholapur maharashtra i wish you very happy bhagwan vardhman mahavir jayanti today we celebrated it it this day with very enthusiastic way please remember the teaching of mahavir non violence is the main principle of this god be non violence to yourself don't torture others by physically as well as mentally live peaceful life live healthy life live satisfied life dear students i know that net exam and set exam is important and easy for you to get the certificate if you want to become a professor you must pass this exam while passing net exam and set exam paper number 1 plays very important role again in paper number 1 if you get very good mark you will get jrf so in paper number 1 i already started teaching on paper number 1 unit number 1 and in this video in this session i am going to tell you the more important points comes under methods of teaching here on the blackboard i wrote 11 most important concept most important teaching methods these are very repeated concept asked in the exam i am telling you only exam point of view information detailed information you can you can read in any any from any book but what i am teaching here what i am telling here what i am saying here what i am writing on the blackboard please remember in your mind the first point is micro teaching what is micro teaching what is team teaching micro teaching team teaching blended learning dialogic teaching brainstorming teaching direct teaching differentiated instruction guided discovery method seminar panel discussion computer assisted learning call computer assisted instruction okay now directly i am going to tell you what is mean by micro teaching micro means small very small very small teaching small teaching is known as micro teaching mini 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 miniature teaching is known as micro teaching one one small part of teaching is known as micro teaching micro teaching means it is a, it is an a technique to teach the teacher how to learn a teaching skill a person who is going to become a teacher that person should learn how to teach to the student that approach is known as micro teaching it this technique this technique is teaching to the students those who are doing d ed course and b ed course i want to teach to the students so before going to teach i must learn how to teach how to teach the subject to the student how to explain the content to the student how to analyze the subject matter to the student which skill we should use while teaching to the student this technique is telling the teacher how to inculcate the teaching skills this technique is used in teacher training course micro teaching this concept was first time introduced by d w do we write dwight w allen dwight w allen he was a professor of education he was working as a professor in the university of stanford 
in america in 1963 he introduced the concept of micro teaching he had given a best definition please remember this question was asked in the jammu kashmir sect exam who introduced micro teaching concept first time d w allen was introduced micro teaching in america in 1909 in 1963 in the university of stanford he had given the definition of micro teaching a scaled down a scaled down means to reduce a scaled down teaching encounter in a class size and a time actually we are going to teach to the student for 30 minutes to the large crowd to the large class after training we are teaching but before 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 teaching to the original class before teaching to the original time we should reduce the class size 10 to 15 teachers are sitting those are training trainee teachers and only 5 minutes 10 minutes time is given the teacher is teaching one skill and all the trainee teachers are listening they are recording they are giving the feedback a scaled down teaching encounter in a class size and time please remember this definition it was asked in uttarakhand set exam teaching skill and teacher training courses micro teaching is used practicing only one skill while teaching to the micro teaching please remember again it is very important how many phases are used how many phases are used in micro teaching 3 acquisition of knowledge knowledge acquisition acquisition of skills and the transfer the teacher who is teaching to the student he should learn first knowledge which subject i am going to teach then how to teach the subject he should know the skill then whatever he learnt he should transform he should deliver he should tell what he has in his mind he should tell to the student he should transform his knowledge how many steps are there in micro teaching six steps again it was a question which was the first step of micro teaching planning the first step is planning second one is teaching third one is feedback fourth one is replan fifth one is reteach and sixth one is refeedback and micro teaching this concept was introduced in india by d d tiwari in allahabad in 1967 please remember who introduced who introduced micro teaching in india dd pujari dd dd tiwari in 1967 in in allahabad okay thank you so much please remember this point and write down in your notebook thank you so much namaste